Young Catholics from all over the world have been gathering in Krakow for World Youth Day. They'll be joined in Poland by Pope Francis later on Wednesday. Some inevitably became unnerved on hearing the news of the latest attack on French soil, this time on a Catholic church by fanatics who took hostages and murdered a priest, apparently using the name of Islam. The Archbishop of Marseille said we shouldn't allow ourselves to be carried away by hatred, by fear and by the desire for revenge because that's what they're looking for, surely. You can imagine that they're trying to pitch us against each other, especially against the Muslim community. From Krakow, the Archbishop of Rouen said news of the priest's murder made him cry to God, imploring others to join him. This young French participant said, it scares me even more because before it was French people being attacked, mainly Jews being attacked, and now it's Christians who are being attacked. We can't be indifferent to the fact that it's Christians. Security surrounding the event in the Polish city had already been tight. The country had put in place border controls in the run-up to an earlier NATO summit and this event. Up to two million people are expected. The previous pope but one, John Paul II, holds an iconic status in Poland, but many Catholics in the conservative nation are said to be concerned about calls by Pope Francis for a change in attitudes towards a more inclusive and merciful church.